Hey there, welcome to our channel. In today's video I will be sharing to you a trick to easily use most of the self buffs of Cardinal without the tedious part of pressing the shortcut keys over and over again. And like in my previous tricks videos, this is possible with the help of a utility software called Auto Hotkey. In this video I am using the Auto Hotkey version 1.1.3. Before we start, I will be showing you my stats and gears. Here I have a plus 10 Sacred Crown to boost the damage of Adormus and negate its gemstone consumption. Sacred Lapel is used to reduce the cooldown of a ratio. My weapon is an Awakened Saint Hall Mace with two true Soren cards. Garmin is a Fairy of Eden with yellow Pitaya card. Ears of Abyss for more magic damage if agility is at 120. White Thread Armor for magic defense ignoring. Shield is Garden of Eden for additional intelligence and dexterity stats. Shoes is Great Hero Boots for fixed cast time reduction. Lastly, two Rings of Adormus to increase the damage of the skill. Costumes and Shadow Gears are also focused in improving the performance of Adormus. My middle and lower costumes are enchanted with High Priest Stones. Garment Costume is enchanted with Archbishop Stone. Shadow Gears is just a basic class set to ignore additional magic defense and reduce the cooldown of Adormus. stats are shown here. Again, agility is at 120 because it is needed for the ears of Abyss. After showing you the stats and gears, we will now look at the skill's shortcut keys. The skills that I have shown you are the skills that are included in the script that we will be using. Now let us look at how I use our main offensive skill without the hotkey first. That's how it will look without the hotkey. Now I will show you the script. Here we can see that I have two AHK files. These files contain the same scripts but different activation hotkey. I will show you what I mean. Let us open one of them with notepad. Here we can see some familiar scripts. There is a basic spam button with mouse clicks here for A. The second part of the script is also a basic spam button with mouse clicks. Expect the mouse cursor moves to a specific coordinates. This key is for safety wall to quickly target self. The third part of the script is a chain of commands after pressing the hotkey. Here I have set the hotkey to one. The idea here is that if you press one, all the buff skills will be used in order based on the script here. Just pressing the hot key will activate all the following commands in order. No need to hold down the key. The sleep time here is set according to our cast time and cast delays. 
feel free to modify these values depending on your stats and gears. At the bottom of the script, we have here two short commands for suspend and reload. Here you can notice that reload is set to 2. The reason for this is that if you want to stop the chain of skills while it is active, you just press 2. The other script in this video is identical to the previous script. I just changed the activation hotkey for the chain of buffs to numpad 1. Also, the reload key is changed to numpad 2. With that shown, let us now activate the hotkey. Let us now try it. Just a fair warning, as much as possible, only buff up while there are no close ranged enemies attacking you if you're going to use the chain of buffs, because the cursor will prioritize targeting enemies first before self. That's it for this short tutorial. I hope you find this helpful, and like always I thank you for watching. If you reached this part of the video consider leaving a like and comment to further increase the reach of this video. Also if you haven't subscribed yet, why not subscribe now to also help me reach the next YouTube milestone. Anyway, thank you again for watching, farewell and happy gaming, see you in the next video.